Air Vice Marshal Abid Rao from Karachi, Ahmad Raza Kasuri from Islamabad, those from the All-Pakistan Muslim League, which is Musharraf's party, General Rashid Qureshi, former spokesperson to Musharraf, former military advisor to Musharraf, Rashni Kher of Roots in Kashmir, Brigadier Rahul Bosley from Delhi, Maruf Raza, Times Now Strategic Affair, Adita, uh, Strategic Affairs, Consulting Editor Strategic Affairs, and Sashadri Chari of the Foreign Affairs Cell of the BJP. Thank you very much. Let's open the debate now. To start with Maruf. You have any doubts now about as far as this new attack which happened last night? We reported first you were live yesterday on the Indian Consulate in mazar -e sharif I want to start with a quick update on that before I ask you the first question on that. At least three terrorists, ladies and gentlemen, killed in a fierce overnight gun battle. These are the pictures with security forces who engaged the terrorists attempting to storm the Indian diplomatic mission. Now, these are Pakistan-backed terrorists backed by the Haqqani network who were trying to attack the Indian uh, consulate in mazar -e sharif Official sources said that the special combat units of the Afghan National Police took on the Haqqani terrorists and recovered three bodies from outside the Indian consulate. Security forces then launched a daunting assault to nail down at least two to three other mercenaries who are holed up in a five-story building about 100 meters from the road from the to the road from the facility they said military choppers of the afghanistan security forces dropped commandos on top of the building holding the terrorists and the battle was inching towards a final assault that's uh, the situation as far as the attack in on the indian diplomatic mission by the Pakistan-backed Haqqani network terrorists in Afghanistan's mazar -e sharif city, which follows the ongoing assault on the airbase in Patan Kot. Uh, Maruf, now this really exposes the Pakistani hand. It also reveals a fair amount of desperation, I think, that they wanted to coordinate these two attacks almost in a way that the two attacks have maximum impact. Uh, Maruf. Uh, Arnab, uh, my assessment is based on historical facts. Uh, the first fact is that in, in the case of Afghanistan, uh, Pakistan, uh, by the admission of various international agencies, including the United States, has been involved at least very clearly in two major attacks on Indian uh, right. missions. One was more recently when Nawaz Sharif came in for Modi's swearing. Yeah. Uh, that was at Herat. And the other was the attack, massive attack in 2008 on the Indian mission in Kabul uh, and adjoining areas which led to at least 54 deaths. Uh, so there is a, a Pakistani uh, footprint there. Uh, the other fact I want to base it on is that Pakistan has uh, made it known repeatedly in international forums and to the Indians that they want India out of Afghanistan despite all the good work that they have done, despite Mr. Modi's recent assertion that India is not there to compete but to contribute. Uh, however, Pakistan uh, continues to be obsessed with the idea of dominating Afghanistan as strategic depth against any Indian invasion, which is a doctrine which came into play uh, in the 1990s, thanks yeah. to General Mirza Aslam Beg. Uh, the third point I want to break out is that uh, Pakistan believes uh, that India's missions are being used against Pakistan and its interests in the AFPAC region and more specifically in Baluchistan. Right. They have repeatedly cited this claim, but they've never come up with concrete so the, evidence. And if they do, I so would Maruf, them to make it internationally public. So, uh, so, 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 the, uh, so, so the simple question, better. Maruf, at this stage, so, I want to ask you know, uh, the Pakistanis, on, uh, Pakistani guests is this. And I hope they'll be a little reasonable on the program tonight. General Qureshi, you know, are you giving your whole strategy away with the Afghan attack continuing parallel to the Pathan court attack? Now, you have to be really foolish because if you wanted some alibis, you could have planned it better. But I see that the element of desperation in Pakistan is clearly grown. What is this desperation stemming from? Where is the desperation of the Pakistani military establishment, General Qureshi, stemming from? Arnab, uh, you keep uh, concluding before you even listen to arguments or listen to other people's views. You've already come to the conclusion that Pakistan is at the back of anything that happens in India or India's interest, whether in Afghanistan or in any other country in the world. It's so unfortunate. We in Pakistan, all of us, uh, and in Mo uh, the recent uh, right. Prime Minister Modi's mm -hmm. visit to Nawaz Sharif, everyone, everyone, and let me tell you this, that this was paved 
by the meeting of the national security advisors right one of who from the pakistani side was also a retired military officer and everyone was looking forward to better relations this is no way to better relations that's in the that's in the past now resolution no no that's in the past now that's in the resolution of issues between no, no, that's India in the pakistan that's in the past in a calm no that's in the past no no what is no manner. no you see yesterday everyone in pakistan no, it is second. so unfortunate yeah it is unfortunate each time it is it is unfortunate no what has happened one minute Gen not everyone sir not everyone not everyone not everyone, not everyone. something in not india not, not everyone but very close no no immediately you report S that pakistan is behind so this. so uh, i would like to ask general qureshi my who do you think pakistan no no who do you think is behind it the nicaraguan rebels out of work right now or some swiss ridiculous. peacekeeper now don't be ridiculous i'm not being ridiculous is, you're being ridiculous is, sir with respect pakistan, general abid pakistan general Ab is, vice marshal abid uh, rao vice marshal abid rao vice marshal abid rao wanted to come in one second i place the facts before you and i want you to be reasonable tonight you know now, you know you what happened when the indian consulate in herat was attacked your argument is null and void sir hear me even as attack <clears throat> details of this attack are emerging the fact that the indian consulate has been targeted clearly raises clear suspicions about pakistan's involvement and i can give you an endless list of reasons tonight as to why you are let's, responsible let's first listen to me arnab yes arnab, no, arnab, no you want you want me, me to cite out the reasons would you not want to hear the reasons of why you are responsible is it difficult for you to hear the reasons then let no, me no, say no. so First, this is the rhetoric and nonsensical listen to me arnab let's go back to pathan court attack i have still not understood what is the objective of these terrorists when we had this attack on mehran and uh, uh, our camera base they destroyed our strategic assets none nothing of that sort has been attacked you your sp police gurdaspur loses his vehicle nothing uh, bell uh, uh, that is because the your army not, is incompetent you know, uh, Yes, number two, your markets a day before in Pathan Court was closed prematurely. All obstructions were removed from there. What kind of these terrorists are there? In three days, they have spent inside the base. You have not been able to clear them. That they have not been able do. to do any that, damage. That is, yes, that's they, no, no, that, 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 no, 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 no
Who killed 58 people and injured Even 145? Even in Afghanistan, you should wait till who Afghan sponsors, government gives you some... Who sponsored the Haqqani network? I mean, you Listen got only uh, who sponsors the Haqqani uh, network. I think I you, think you, you love your voice. Your is poor. You don't talk of other countries, other agencies. After putting who can the questions, uh, combat uh, put India? Full stop, you have your home grown here there. The party. You have got so many movements going in your country. Why don't you look person. at them? You're, you're arguing with the Pakistani, not with me right now. That is... That is no, there's no use getting personal with me. Uh, Ahmad Raza Kasuri, who bombed the Indian embassy in Kabul in July 2008 that killed 58 people and injured 145 people. And is it true or not, Ahmad Raza That's Kasuri, that days after the Indian embassy was attacked by the Taliban, the then National Security Advisor M.K. Narayanan got a call from the head of the U.S. National Security Agency called General Keith Alexander informing him that the bombers' calls had been traced to ISI yes. officials in Peshawar. You ought to be ashamed of yourself. You ought to be utterly ashamed of yourself for repeating the same old antics again and again. Ahmad Raza Kasuri. You ought to apologize for repeatedly trying to defend listen the indefensible. To now, you listen know, to me. You know, you listen know. Listen to me now. No, you listen to me, sir. Evidence was presented by a U.S. senior journalist proving no, no, that Afghan officials had tra traced no, the Indian no, no, calls to Peshawar. Stop it. No. Why presenting the evidence? You, you say joint investigation. Nonsense. I'm presenting the evidence now. I'm presenting evidence to you. Why are you getting angry? Anchor person. But I am presenting evidence so to you. so obnoxious as an anchor person. I am presenting evidence to you about the Pakistani involvement in previous attacks what on Indian installations you are, you are in Afghanistan. <laughs> Why? Counter my evidence. evidence. is his word. Counter my evidence. Don't get personal with me. Counter my evidence. Who killed 17 what, what people? What are you are talking about? I am telling you about what you have done. I am telling you about your track record. It embarrasses you. Given a instruction by the raw to create this kind of a situation? Well, I don't know. I am giving you facts here tonight. Did 17 people, were they killed in a suicide bombing? Outside the Indian Embassy in Kabul, you think we have forgotten that? Army. Five, five terrorists have not been controlled by you. Look at us. You see, 140 children were killed within Six hours, we control the whole situation. This is the level of your army. This what is this is the of kind of unfortunate argument that you present, which really you are talking this is, about this is an unfortunate. Sir, remember, nine <laughs> people, including six children, were killed in a suicide attack outside the Indian <laughs> consulate in Jalalabad in August 2013. You have blood on your hands. You are no match to Pakistan. You have blood army. on your hands, so you are admitting the you're, Pakistani you're, involvement in by saying so. The, by saying so, by saying so, by saying you are no match, you have actually on Indian television admitted Pakistani involvement. And you sit there as a Pakistani politician, you, you sit there, justify the Pakistani involvement, you want to celebrate it. You want to celebrate cowardice. You want to celebrate duplicity. You want to celebrate mercenaries. You want to celebrate the height of shamelessness, Ahmad Raza Kasuri. Now I want to hand over to Seshadri Chari. Seshadri Chari. Modi visited Pakistan <coughs> yeah. and your, uh, your, yeah, what? your hawks do not want a peaceful negotiation to proceed further. It is done by your hawkish element to put a stopple to this uh, process of uh, I want Shishadri Chari to respond to this. No, no, watch it, watch it, watch it. Watch it. This, this is the silliest thing I've heard in a long Arnav. time. Seshadri Chari. Seshadri Chari, Maruf Arnav after that. No, no. Arnav. No, no. Seshadri Ch 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 Chari will respond to that. Seshadri Chari will respond to said, all that tripe right now. What you, what you said about Pakistan and the Pakistani army has been proved by these people from uh, across the border who are on your show. You very correctly used two words, desperation and Pakistan army exposed. Your army has got no competition absolutely, with the absolutely, type of training and discipline and the professionalism as as, that we have as far in the as, Pakistan army. As far as army's competence is concerned, Four let me tell this gentleman, have not been, been controlled by you let from me tell this gentleman that, we, that you have inflicted three wars on us and you have got a bloody nose all the three times. And in 1971, Indian Army has proved that we could take 90,000 of your people as hostages here. Please come out of 71. Talk and of then, today. And Three then, days and then give them and back to you. And then give them back to you. And then give them back to you. 
Forget Not about only the that, past. You should call Afghan. We have a very recent Pathan Court base. Very, what are you talking? In a, very in a recent manner. Very recently. Don't talk about the 19,000 troops that very you, recently, they were locked I, up in India. I can, Forget I can, about that I can go on. I can go on. Very recently, just six, seven no, months you are back, begging to in a hot pursuit. You go to 1927 when Babar attacked India. In a hot pursuit. Let us speak why interrupting. You are continuous. I will continue. Continue, Sashadri Chari. Continue. Continue, Sashadri Chari. We inflicted so much casualty on your side that you had to come begging. And oh, in the please DGMO come out to today's talks, incident. You, you forget about 70 years. Yeah, continue, Sashadri Chari. And, and as far as today's incident, as far as Patan Court incident is concerned, it only proves how, what to what extent of cowardice you can go. And now, the next theory that you are going to tell us is that United Jihad Council actually has its headquarters in Times Now building. I am waiting for you to say that because once you say that, your other generals can Mr. very easily Shashadri say. be you reasonable. Can, not listen to Sashadri. Continue, Sashadri. You can very easily say that this attack was actually masterminded at the Prime Minister's office in New Delhi. Short of saying this, you have not covered yourself with glory. We are not saying that. We are. But we are. Let it be assessed are, properly. Let it be investigated. To talk. You we are, are blaming us. I am not blaming you. We are going to continue our talks at the political level. But please let me That's tell you. That's very good. Please let me tell you. We are going to inflict an injury on Pakistani army, whoever it is. We care two hoots for who that is. We are going to destroy I hope this wisdom kind prevails. of attitude. I hope wisdom prevails. We are going to destroy this kind of attitude on the part of the Pakistani you army. You are thinking of destroying Pakistan army. And what are you yes. talking? See, that is the first the step. Paradise? That is the first step. You are begging for peace to that the That is the first world. step. And Mr. Modi came with the if we don't, agenda to have if peace we, in the region. If we don't destroy, if we don't destroy that, let me tell you, this attitude of yours will destroy Pakistan. The choice we is will, before you. We will succeed. You want to destroy these terrorist camps? Have to show to the, or you want these terrorists to destroy to your country? Brahmans. We will be happy. Khatris. We are destroying them anyway. We are destroying them anyway. You are no. not no, Abid destroying Rao, them. Abid Rao. I am sorry. Abid Rao. You are not Abid destroying Rao. them. Abid Rao. Yes. Abid Rao. You are I, importing I, I, terrorism. Yeah, yeah, one sec. Mr. Abid Rao, Air Marshal Abid Rao, I have the greatest respect and regard for yes. you. Please don't lose that Sir, record. Thank you very much. There are some people I in Delhi still to left. I request you not to get into the blame think, game. Well, who sure think, let's investigate this. No. Let's share some information. Take ah, it is Nara not a blame game. Those terrorists, maybe we get Bagal Air Marshal Abid Rao. Bagal this Bagal is not Bagal blame Bagal game. Please don't get into blame game. No, don't call it blame game. Don't call it blame game. This is blame you know game. the truth. Is talking you you know the truth. And you are saying you that know the truth. Pakistan. We know your. You know the truth. And we are. And the truth is out in the open. I am being Truth neutral. Out in the I felt Truth sorry for this attack no. on an no. air force base. No, no, no. We don't. The airmen who have lost their neutral. lives. No, no. I'm air Marshal Abid Rao, for God's sake, don't be neutral. Accept, accept that the Pakistani army, two incidents have happened. One in Patan no. Court and one in Kabul. The servants let, are different, let but that the be masters proven. are the same. Let that be proven, please. The, yeah, servant, you know, the servants Otherwise, are different. You know, we will end but up the servants are different. Provoking the people to have been the same. Correct. Agencies and through your uh, the masters okay. are the same. Okay, answer two questions. Two questions to the Pakistani guests. Rashni, Kher and Brigadier Bosley are also free to come in after ask these two questions. My first question is to General Rashid Qureshi. And Brigadier Bosley and uh, uh, Rashni Kher will respond. Now, General Qureshi, you have worked with Musharraf. Now, you know what Musharraf really is and was. I'm sure you know. I'm sure you know that in 2015, Musharraf admitted being a terrorist leader. He made an open admission. He gave no, interviews. He gave. He gave. No, don't, 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 no, don't stop me. Let me. I'll present the evidence. You say present the evidence. Sure. Musharraf 
openly admitted in a yes, series of interviews in 2015, which I'm about to quote right now. Don't stop me, Mr. Kasuri. Don't stop me. Don't stop me like Nawaz Sharif took money from Osama bin Laden. Musharraf was a terrorist leader. He gave an interview to The Guardian on the 13th of February. You pick up your phones and do a Google search right now, in which he said, yes, we have been building these proxies. I know it is unhealthy to do so. It is most unhealthy, he says, to build proxies. But we have been building proxies. These are the proxies you unleash via the Haqqani network in Afghanistan and the lashkar e toiba and jaish e Mohammed on Indian soil. Can you deny that Musharraf also admitted that he had been cultivating the Taliban? And Musharraf admitted that Pakistani spies in the inter-services intelligence have been cultivating the Taliban because they did not like the Karzai government. You want me to tell you more? You want me to tell you more Let tonight? Me answer this. You want me to tell you more tonight? Then understand that it is Go also ahead, said, he also said, time listen time to me, Mr. Kasuri, time has come for you to learn the bitter truth. Tonight, oh, Musharraf said, to me, Musharraf I'm said, though this will be answered only by Qureshi. Oh, only General Qureshi will answer tonight. Only General Qureshi will answer tonight to this question. And my question is, don't defend your leader. Quit the party which is headed by a terrorist leader. Now listen, in August 2007, Musharraf, the terrorist leader, also admitted that there is no doubt that Afghan terrorists are supported from Pakistani soil. Now, General Qureshi, is your leader a liar? Mr. Kasuri, is your leader a liar? Will you on Indian television this. declare Musharraf a liar for having he, said all this? He stand for peace. Did he say all he this or not? What do you mean you stand for peace? Tell me, was Musharraf a liar when he now, said all this? Now, listen. That is the answer to your question your tonight. Wedding. No, you tell me. Not the way to, 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 to talk about a leader. It's, it's okay. A tell me, was Musharraf a liar? Instead when of he being said rational, so. instead of being rational, you are being emotional. I am not emotional in the least. I am being utterly rational. I am quoting your leader. You I saying. have quoted your leader. You para chapter and wrong. verse. Answer my you question, Mr. Kure General Kureshi. Answer my question. Yourself. Answer the, the question. Is, Did your leader you declare himself a terrorist leader by making these statements or not? Is what? absolutely incorrect. Incorrect? And you, want said, you, want in quote quote you want me to quote it? You want me to quote it? You want me to quote it? Which I have not heard. Which you have frankly, not heard, which I am quoting to you tonight. To comment on what I am quoting saying. to you tonight but the following Anab, facts. I am quoting to you the following part facts. Is that you are far removed from rationality. You know something. And instead you want to curry, you want to curry why, favor with I your leader who is a terrorist Anab, leader. Let me answer this question. You tell me, did Musharraf me make that question. admission? You start, Anab, you no, start no, I'm sorry. with allegations. I'm not, no allegations. And you start with conclusions. I'm sorry. Without Don't analyze my questioning skills. Side, you don't have to analyze my questioning skills. Conclude, answer my questions. You, People across India are watching just, you tonight. In 81 countries, they I'm, are watching you I'm tonight. General Qureshi, aapke if you have a answer, then give a answer. If you don't have an answer, then ask me. If you don't have an answer, then you have an answer. If you don't have an answer, then give a answer. Now give a answer. I have quoted your leader. Do you have an answer? What will you give? You are giving an answer in the past 10 minutes. I am asking you, why did Musharraf make these statements? Musharraf has admitted why we have proxy terrorists used. Why? Why? Which way you are doing that Musharraf has not done it. You are saying that Musharraf has said what he said. He said that we have cultivated the Taliban. Now admit it. Really admit it. Hold on, hold on. Look, look. Is your leader alive? Use your brain. Use your brain. Arnab, give me a moment. The Taliban were there long before Musharraf became the head of so was musharraf not using his brains when so he said this saying was musharraf not using his brains when wrong. he said this was musharraf not using his brains when he said you this aren't. I, I was know, he using his brains I when he said this? You are not using no, he was not using his brains when he tried Kargil. He went selectively. No, I'm not quoting anything selectively. I'm being history. direct with you, as, as direct as anyone can be. Why so did musharraf admit supporting proxies, terrorists, and the Taliban? Miss an opportunity if you get one of Pakistan bashing
and today you are in that kind of are bhai i am quoting your former president pakistan bashing rashni ke rashni ke and bring it up post there rashni ke please yes rashni ke please not one answer tonight i'll send you the quote after the program is over see it has it is it is no secret it is no secret in pakistan that shahbaz sharif the brother of the acting prime minister is supporting are bhai qureshi ji are bhai aap mujhe suniye aap mujhe suniye ya to dekhiye qureshi dekhiye kasuri ji dekhiye कसूरी जी एक मिनट नो नो वन सेकंड कसूरी जी कसूरी जी आप जवाब दे सकते हैं तो जवाब दे नहीं तो भारत के सारे लोग हिंदुस्तान में देख रहे हैं आज और देखेंगे कि पाकिस्तानी के दो एक जनरल एक एयर मार्शल और एक पॉलिटिशियन बैठे हुए हैं जवाब नहीं दे पाते जब कहा जाता है कि उनके फॉर्मर प्रेसिडेंट मुशरफ आतंकवादियों को पना दे रहे थे अरे भाई जवाब तो दीजिए आप ये कोर्ट से आपके लीडर के वॉज यूजिंग इज ब्रेन दिस यस रशनी केर इनफ Rashni Kher You see I am What? I am reading from a book I by Ahmed Rashid who is a very well known journalist in Pakistan there I there it is he says with ISI officers by his side Azhar Masood tour the country giving rousing speeches marry for jihad birth for jihad and earn money only for jihad till the cruelty of India ends So if you are saying I have another book by by Hussein Haqqani the the ambassador of pakistan to uh, america who has very clearly written that jaish e mohammed has always oh, been is, the right is, hand is an of the ISI, of CIA, and it has been very clearly known to all generals in pakistan that these people are supported supported and personality you know, in pakistan given, pardon don't talk don't talk of hakani He has got no credibility. I don't give a damn. But he writes quantity. this in his book. He can be okay, sold to India. Okay, and it's a very well-read book. CIA. And what about Ahmed Rashid? He is also hated in Pakistan. I don't think so, sir. I can quote you Ayesha Siddiqui. We can. We have hundreds of books from Pakistani writers who are very clear about. Who I will tell you. Even Hillary Clinton these, these has written a book saying the, the same thing. How does it matter? Apart from the Hakkani, every nation has the right to build their own groups for their national of your backward. Which has not been operated in many ways. Don't plug in that poor man. That is the interest of India. These Taliban so will enter into Lucknow, Bombay, and Calcutta. We are stopping them. We are stopping them at a at a what cost? We are taking care of your backyard instead oh. of thanking us. You are raising your ugly finger. No, are, are you saying that these you calls that these terrorists them. made, they were, they were not made to Pakistan. They were addressed to Honolulu. <laughs> you see, these, there are call records, call sir, and we know that these Shana people Shana came from Pakistan. The there is no doubt the in anybody's mind that these people are Pakistani trained military trained people. Or the army continue to tell lies on your national media. You are misleading Second, your people. You are misleading your nation. And end, let me tell you, you were talking about country. about Indian Army. They they destroyed your air force base, and you could do nothing. The very terrorists, the very snakes that you had in your backyard, destroyed your air force base We in Maran, killed so many people, and yes, your army is helpless. Well, they rebel. At least in our days, our forces are strong terrorists. enough to avert an attack. The our brave hearts have been sacrificed. Out all the terrorists. Please in don't mix Europe, your incompetence with the event. In ten years, yeah, but they destroyed so many aeroplanes in the Mehran Air Base. Why are you not saying that? Your coward army is trained. We got them in the air. India, they were not your army. They did not fight a frontal war. Every time they have fought, they have given. They have been, they have been dragged back. You have lost half of your nation and are verge of losing a one fourth of it again in Balochistan. Why don't you get your lessons straight and right for once and for all, sir? Please. Remain restricted to the event. Yeah, More we are on the event. Arnab Goswami's programs. You go. Why it is? I think he is. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. I, I, sorry. You, I think. I think I'm sorry. I haven't got an answer to my question. Out out I think Rashni Kher's questions are extremely relevant tonight. Rashni Kher's questions are very relevant tonight. You see. You see this. You see the. I'll tell you. I'll tell you. I'll tell you the situation of Pakistan today. You are. You are. One second. One second. One second. One second. One second. Mohammed killed thirty. Eight Kashmiris, Kashmiri Muslims in the summer of 2002, in 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 outside the Kashmir Assembly. 
This is your Jashim Mohammed. They called Srinagar offices of journalists and told them, yes, we have done it. Is this your... Is Please this put a final date of historical charge sheet. And you expect what happened me to be in 1527? Let's start but from damn, there. My foot, I will not remain restricted. I mean, 2002, this happened. 2008, this happened. Yeah. 90, uh, 71, this happened. Yeah. Where do you want to stop? I'll tell you. One second. Let me tell you, 2011, you missed out 2011, Air Marshal. You know what happened in 2011? 2011... Pakistan realized it can't be the leader of terrorists, so it became a middleman for terrorists. Aren't you ashamed of your status in the Committee of Nations, led by leaders who ashamed. want to be middlemen of terrorists? The situation changing. Did you or did we you not in 2011? In 2011, listen to my question. Listen to my question, Amarshal. In 2011, a terrorist, terrorist country. Amarshal, did you try? Did you try? Did you try to mediate? Did you, you putting against Parvez Musharraf? Did you try Parvez to... Parvez Musharraf had the courage to say the truth. I'll tell you what Parvez Musharraf did. And I'll tell you what, what he did with the Haqqani network. But as far as I know, in 2011, you as a government tried to mediate as middlemen with the Haqqani network, a group of terrorists and the US government and those negotiations Because we failed. wanted peace. Yeah, but why were because you a mediator? We why were you a mediator? That proved your links with the terrorists. What would a mediator... You were a mediator and a middleman. That's why you were dealing I'm with the terrorists. Today, it is no your secret. Government has been talking to it is no secret. In southern in India, in eastern India, and so many countries. And it is and no secret. Right, you can and, do that. And it is, and it is no secret that. either. Look at how Rashid Qureshi has no answer tonight. It is no secret that the Haqqani network was involved have, in training several answer. fighters in Pakistani territory and we to be sent into Kashmir. And this was done with the active support of the Pakistani state. Give me one factual response tonight. The fact that you are aiding and abetting the Haqqani network is not lost on anyone in 2011 and not lost on anyone on now. Uh, as recently as October this year, you were pulled up. You were pulled up by your chief benefactor, the United States, that Pakistan has not done enough to provide sanctuary to, to not provide sanctuary to the Haqqani network in Pakistan the whole world dreaming everyone makes these comments raw I mean you answer one question factually tonight Mr. Kasuri it appears you have no response tonight it will go according to that it is it may not suit India if you stop talking simple as that yes Rashid Kureshi explanation to you yes Rashid we wanted to condole the yes Rashid Kureshi and Brigadier Bosle the bad attack of terrorists Rashid Kureshi is taking on Brigadier Bosle after this blame game yes Rashid Kureshi tonight well, the operation is. And on, what is this? And by the way, by the way, what is this United Jihad Council? This bunch of clowns who you are putting under one group, Harkatul Ansar, Nam Badalte Rente, Hezbul Mujahideen, Jamaate Mujahideen, Al Jihad, Al Burk, Al Badar, Ikhwanul Musalman, Tehrikul Mujahideen, Lashkar e Toiba, Harkatul Mujahideen, Al Badar, Tehrik e Jihad. Aren't you, up, up, aren't you sick and tired? Focus. Aren't you sick and tired of changing names? The whole world has made you a laughing stock. You know them more than we do. No, you tell me, General, where, where are all these people? Why do these, this group and that group, why do they emerge only in your country? Pakistani soil has some <coughs> special sort of fertile soil for terrorists? You put some spe special sort of fertilizers into that soil? Please you tell me. Look Arnab. inward, Arnab. You I am asking you to in look inward also. and I am asking you tonight how a terrorist holds a rally in Muzaffarabad on July 15, 2015, 2014, inviting the Al Qaeda and the Taliban to support the jihadi groups fighting the Indian army in Kashmir. Only in your country would this be allowed. Image of what kind of country are you? Gone to the winds. What kind of country no, are you? We are unfortunate to have you as neighbors. It is unfortunate, you with it is unfortunate that we have Lebanon, you as neighbors, Lebanon, but aren't you embarrassed of yourself? You are a parody of a nation. On which your state was resting. No, no, but you are a parody of a nation. Has gone to the winds. You see, you, yes, we are a parody of a nation, and you are scared of that. All I can say. That. But you tell me, you I tell mean, me, how does a terrorist, how's a, how, how does a terrorist hold press conferences in Karachi? You're only irresponsible. How I'm does what is I'm irresponsible? I mean, really, uh, a terrorist, uh, Air Marshal, please be careful with the choice of words. How does a terrorist hold press conferences in Karachi? How do you allow a terrorist to hold press conferences in Karachi? Your terrorists yeah. hold press conferences in Bombay. Yeah, and no, no, one second. Please answer the question. Shana is a terrorist organization. Sun RSS is a terrorist and, and organization. They hold not only Bavel, Bavel, Rash, yeah. press Rashnik conferences. Rashnik, they, no, you will be taken on now. Action. You will be taken on now. All the opponents. Because the time for the, no, the time for decency is over. Rashnik, Rashnik, to me. Rashnik, he was he was released. He was released for IC814 in, in Kabul. How did he come level. to Bhavalpur? And like if he is that. there, how is he raising but money? You how are you not arresting him? What happens there? How are you not arresting him? How is he roaming free? Did you arrest he is an international terrorist. His son is, is there now. Why don't you arrest him? How are you not arresting He's him? He's killed so many people. No, no. How did... Oh, come on. What are you comparing, sir? 
What are you comparing, sir? Bala Sahib Thakre is dead. I am comparing you know that political Who terrorist. You? Be careful of what you say. If you don't know what they're to say, please don't cross your lines. They are hurting people. And, and, and aren't you hurting people? Aren't you tired? How, how is a man who is released for IC? IC814 hijack operation. How, I am what not is supporting he that. He should also be behind bars. He should be. Why isn't he? Bal no, no, he, he should be. Good, good. He should be. Why, why isn't he? I am why, not why isn't he? Not no, one second. One second. One second. He should be. I agree with you. I agree with you. He should be. I agree with you that he should be. A Marshal. A Marshal, I agree with you that he should be. Because. No, no, no. Rashnik, 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 they are admitting now. They are admitting. They are admitting. Just one minute. I get, yeah. I get Mr. Bosley on the other side. Now, one second. Mr. Parnab, you should be sent Thank to you. the mental hospital Thank you. for treatment. <laughs> Thank you very much. You know something, I won't, I won't tell you which kind of uh, asylum you should be sent into because I don't believe in using indecencies. <laughs> but coming from, a, coming from a hardened, you know, Pakistani, nothing surprises me anymore. I can only tell you that your, your level of your arguments today match the eloquent, literary level of a terrorist called Sayyid Salahuddin. You can match Sayyid Salahuddin and Hafiz Said word to word in the kind of language and intellect that you display on television, Mr. Kasuri. Now, please, people are watching you, at least don't embarrass your own country. J Colonel Bosley, Colonel Bosley, today, Air Marshal admits. Your country. Today, Air Marshal admits. This is the level of an anchor. I don't, I don't respond to gutter level language, media. sir. I don't respond to gutter level language. I'm, I'm arguing tonight. To my point, no, I'm arguing on fact. You argue with me on fact. Don't believe in listening to other. No, my point is, uh, Air Marshal today says, let me ask General Qureshi, please. General Qureshi, Air Marshal says, Air Marshal says, Air Marshal says, once Air Marshal said terrorists should be in jail. He says, yes, the jaish e Muhammad chief should not be a free man in Pakistan. My question to you is, why is he a free man in Pakistan? You tell me, General Quraysh. I'm sure you agree with Air Marshal that the jaish e Muhammad chief should not be a free man in Pakistan. Then why is he a free man in Pakistan? First, Masood Azhar. First of all, now, yeah. what we need to... What he's we not need a free to, man. Of course, he's a free man. Which jail is he in? What do you mean he's not a free man? He's a free man roaming around southern Pakistan. You want me to give, give you the GPS coordinates? No, no, no. He's a free man. You allow no, him to be a free man. Syed Salaud is a free man. No Masood Azhar is a free man. Lakwi is a free man. Hafi Said is a free man. What about what? Let me, let me. I asked the question to General. I asked the question to General Rashid Qureshi. General Qureshi, why is he a free man? Why don't you get? Why is he a free man? We want a joint operation. We want to start with the Jaish e Muhammad chief. Why is he a free man? It is your obligation as a member of hopefully the civilized committee of nations, which I am beginning to get increasingly doubtful of, that if a man who was responsible for the hijack of IC814 is a free man on your soil, is responsibility for you to tie him up? and hand him over. Why aren't you doing that? Why is he a free man? You tell me. He even, he even tried Why is he a free man? He tried to kill Rashid Qureshi's ex-boss, General Musharraf. No, let him reply. Or na no, let him reply. Why is he a free man? No reply from the Pakistan. No, no, no reply from you, General Qureshi. You've asked, you've asked questions in such a jumbled form and you do not even wait for an answer. He is living in... How can you then, then say that this they are unable to reply. The point is, there is a system in place in Pakistan, like oh, there's a system, system in, place in place in India, where system. What now, system? You see, if if you don't want to listen, no. What system? Explain. No, no, I want to understand. All the viewers of across India now, want to understand this Pakistani now, system. Now, Please understand the system. About, He's going to explain to us the Pakistani system. Just Continue. Just a minute ago, you were saying yes to Mr. Kasuri that he should. Not embarrass. What was my question? Brigadier Bosley, what was my question? Who's embarrassing yourself? Brigadier Bosley, no, answer my question. Why is he a free man? Why is he a free man? You answer my question, no? Why is he a free man? General Qureshi, simple question. Why is he a free man? Why is he a free man? Brigadier Bosley, Brigadier Bosley, Brigadier Bosley wants to respond to you. It's very obvious. Brigadier Bosley. It is very, very obvious. Arnab, Arnab, it is very obvious. Arnab, it is very obvious that he's a free man because he's a strategic asset. He's a strategic asset of the Pakistan Army and the ISI. That is why he's a free man. Yes. It is not only uh, not Masood Azhar, but also not Hafiz Saeed. It is also Syed Salahuddin. Uh, it is also Lakhiu Rahman Lakhvi. All these are strategic assets of the Pakistan Army. And that is why they are uh, the free men. Uh, the, about, they can make any statement. And the Pakistani uh, the gentlemen on the show were trying to say that when Prime Minister Modi visited uh, the country and they welcomed him and they welcomed the peace offer, 
but at the same time they allowed hafiz said to make a statement in lahore openly condemning the visit they allowed hafiz said to openly st make a statement uh, condemning the meeting between uh, mr nawaz sharif and prime minister modi in paris now that is the type of double games they are allowing that and uh, that is the type of uh, activities they permit these so called strategic assets to do no yeah and, so uh, so they are so, not even acknowledging that so, so, part, so partly they acknowledge no no so question is no no question you, is you, you talk you talk about the desperation the you talk about desperation it is more than desperation it is double desperation today the pakistan army and the isi are face, facing a double desperation their strategy in afghanistan has completely collapsed it was uh, the uh, india has made such an impact in afghanistan after the inauguration of the parliament building by the prime minister and the afghan president secondly the salma dam is coming on road thirdly or uh, the afghan government has shifted it, it's uh, the negotiate uh, uh, the shifted uh, from being uh, friendly, uh, friendly towards pakistan towards you, you to india it, uh, they lost out Indian on the, the uh, lost out of the loyalty and the, 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 the your, friendship which were one with president gandhi because of the similar like army will not stop losing battle in afghanistan, oh, please, in afghanistan. Please, yes please please, please, please. i mean there so is no need for desperation the second desperation is a double desperation for the pakistan army and the isi the second desperation they are facing now in india where they are finding that the the top for the as land you find that the pakistan army and, and the isi they will have maroof no and sheshadri chari one second one second one second maroof sheshadri chari sheshadri chari and maroof please one second brigadier bosle brigadier bosle i have sirf ek ek sawal hai aaj mera sheshadri chari mera sawal kya tha are bhai kasuri ji kasuri kasuri have not been able to control four terrorists i'll tell you what level i'll tell you what we will control fighting against pakistan i will i we will control we will control very well don't worry don't don't forget don't forget don't one one minute don't forget those what were those 90000 losers who we handed back to you in 1971 forgot that anyway sheshadri chari my question oh, to you sheshadri chari is this when my, my question India. to sheshadri chari is this sheshadri chari you know 90000 losers it's all right all it's India not a loss of you lost you handed over oh, you begged oh, you were given talking oh, i didn't know bro no, 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 why do you get provoked by it look at the stupid man i, I don't oh, understand why you get provoked by it I don't yeah one second no, no, no the, bus babar hai pakistan ke haath tod denge pair nikaloge border ka pair tod denge sir nikaloge sir kaat ke rakh denge aao aap aao mr kasuri play that's that's really amusing anyway <laughs> that's very amusing my question is my question is my question is why is why is this man a free man i am marshal admitted today that he should not be a free man sheshadri chari with you on one side and rashid qureshi on the other If the air marshal admits that the Masood Azhar no, should I, not I be a free man, Seshadri Chari, Seshadri Chari and Rashid Qureshi, Seshadri Chari and Rashid Qureshi, why is Masood Azhar a free man? Why is Saleh Syed Salahuddin a free man? Can you tell General Qureshi, please, why, in your view, they are free men? Why, why no, Colonel Parod is a free <coughs> man? He is a free man. He is a free man because that is the system in Pakistan. You don't understand. he was trying to explain the system the system that the pakistani people are now the people, guests on your show are trying to uh, actually explain is that in our country there is no freedom of speech there is no democracy you can be a free person if you are a declared terrorist in india or if you can perpetrate as many terror acts on india as possible remain a faithful servant of the isi take money from the pakistani army and work as mercenaries not true. and create problems. what do you mean not true general qureshi this is the system this is the system not that they general are general qureshi these are the facts this he is, is presenting this is the system that they have perfected general qureshi these are facts this is the system this is also the perception of people for globally these years this is the perception general qureshi you can't live in denial you should be concerned Russia's. about the future of That's your country you should be Nonsense. concerned Arna. when you let Arna. these Arna. terrorist Arna. militia lose in your country do you Stupid think they statement. do you think they are not going to hit you eventually your country will break apart general qureshi you should be concerned for the future of your country not celebrate the fact that you sent a few mercenaries over to remain hold up in an air base I for two days a different situation yes general qureshi general qureshi quiet are bhai general qureshi ko bolne de kasuri ji now pakistan army is a very hard hitting army yeah we know how hard hitting army we know how yeah we saw how hard hitting it was during kargil kargil mein dekh liya kitna hard hitting hai anyway anyway troops rashid qureshi rashid qureshi and maroof closing the debate they have not been able to flush out terrorism from the pakistan 
Look at after, our, after our, listening. Our, our professionalism and our training. Acha, now calm down. Now come now. Now, now, now after, after listening to these you people, give me one minute before you close your program. That's your level of your army. Okay, Maruf Raza and General Rashid Qureshi and Sashad Richari on the screen, and we are closing the debate in three minutes. One second, General Qureshi, why is your free man? General Qureshi and Maruf. Or now, can I, can yeah. I please? Yeah. Or now, let me let me ask the Pakistani guests three questions, and these are based on facts. <clears throat> Didn't Hillary Clinton say that if you keep snakes in your backyard, they will one day bite you? And this was clearly a reference to the Taliban and the Taliban leaders they were cultivating in Pakistan. Didn't General, firstly, secondly, didn't General Javed Ashraf, who was DGISI, admit to your parliament that Hafi, uh, this guy, uh, Mashood Azhar, was responsible for killing thousands of Kashmiris and attacking the Indian parliament? when this man had run out of favor after attacks on General Musharraf, didn't General Shahid Aziz write the entire account of Kargil even embarrass you? And Air Marshal Abid Rao, sir, did you not make the famous remark when General Musharraf decided to go into Kargil that we'll either all be court-martialed or there will be martial law yeah, in Pakistan. Yeah. Well, you sir. proved right. Yeah, let Rashid Qureshi respond to you. Mr. Uh, no, Rashid Qureshi's response. You, Mr. Last response of Rashid Qureshi. He, he was an officer at that time. Arna, he was the Arna, military Arna, advisor. No, Rashid Qureshi. Rashid Qureshi's response. Only Rashid Qureshi. Mr. Kasuri, only Rashid Let me give the last point. You are saying, you are saying you are very professional army. You are a very professional army. You are bogged down for several years in Waziristan. You called it Zarbe Azab, an American commentator who's written an authoritative book okay, on your army, closing. calls it Zarbe Bakwas. Who are you trying to fool? Rashid Qureshi. And you are trying to tell us that we don't know how to fight? Aapne kai baar to koshish kar li, aur har baar aapki naakho me se ghoor nikal gaya. Why do you want to keep being blustered against us? Why do you use terrorists against us? Why don't you send regular soldiers against us? And we will show you what we are all about. Go Why do you use proxies? Because your army uh, doesn't have the nerve okay, we are, to fight us. Okay, okay, one second. I gave I gave many opportunities Kasturi for you to respond, but I don't, I don't think I have no I have no desire to get into a debate with you. Because you produce please you produce the lowest opinion that Pakistanis can produce against India. Rashid you are Qureshi, an I gave you three chances to, to respond, but you're not going to. Your support. party, to your country. Okay, one second. You're Rashid, a wonderful Qureshi. human being. I, I, I am having to close and this debate. Address. You are a very timid. Now I am having to close this debate. If Rashid Qureshi wishes to respond, please do. I am asking the question for the hundredth <coughs> time tonight. Why is he a free man, Rashid Qureshi? You please respond. Why is Masood Azhar a free man? Now, now, why is he a free man? Why don't you stop talking then? You, well, you okay, can ask the gentleman to your left. Repeat it about 10 more times. So you answer. So that there is no time left for anyone to answer. It's such a... It's a I, I pity, uh, Arnab, the way you conduct discussions. And you neither give time to people to respond. Sir, if you can respond, why is he a free man? Time no, he why is Masood Azhar a free man? Answer the question or now you're wasting General time. Why is Masood Azhar a free man? General Qureshi, don't go in circles. General Qureshi, don't go in circles. Get to the point. Why is Masood Azhar a free man? Get to the point. Why is he a free man? One of you answer tonight, General Qureshi. Why is Masood Azhar a free man? Arnab, he will never answer. Why? Because Why? he has Kureshi no answer tonight. Party to the whole game. Free man. I ask you a question. I ask you a counter question. Laughing is not the answer tonight, General Qureshi. You're giving your you're giving yourself away. The question is asked and will be asked Why again. He's a free man. Hand over Masood Azhar to a free man. Why Modi is a free man? Right Why now, now since the man. since the level of the debate the has become Allah. ludicrous, I thank Allah. you very much for joining me on yeah, debate number one. Allah. And I did not get an answer to my question on why Masood Azhar no, no. is a free I think, man. I think I, think I thank I you all for joining me on debate number one on the news hour tonight.